Hello, everyone. I'd just like to take a few moments to tell you a little bit about our math summer camp uh, that will be happening. This is the second summer we've been doing this, and it was really very successful last summer. And, um, and really, I guess, due to popular demand, we're doing it again this summer. But we also are extending it a bit. And so let me just mention a little bit about who it's for and what that uh, additional thing that we're offering this summer. Uh, it's really designed for students who need a little bit of extra support before they go into the school year, just to give them a confidence boost to allow them to be a little bit more successful. Uh, and in particular, we could say that it, it's going to be helpful for those that are in our math academy to prepare them for the coming school year, but it's also for students for instance, that are in uh, a brick and mortar school who aren't in that can't be in our math academy, but want a little bit of kind of what we offer here in terms of uh, the, our approach to math and also to give them a little bit of a confidence boost before they enter their math classroom as well. So it's for really for both groups. Uh, I want to emphasize that uh, this summer camp does have a little bit more of a skills focus than would normally be the case because again, it's designed for students who need a little bit more of that skills work. And we want to uh, help to give them uh, a little bit more experience with things, you know, for instance, in the younger grades with fractions and the older grades, working a little bit more with algebra um, to really help to solidify some of those skills, a little bit of refresher. It's for three weeks. Uh, starting at the end of July. And of course, even though I just mentioned we're doing more skills work than normal, I don't think it's possible for me to teach math without trying to make it a little bit fun and doing some puzzles and so forth. So we'll have a generous amount of puzzles worked in as well. Uh, I should mention who the teachers are. Uh, I'm teaching the sixth and seventh grade. Um, I I am teaching the sixth and seventh grade math summer camps. Again, each camp is separate just for that one particular grade. Uh, Sean Aronson, who's been a longtime tutor for us and does a fantastic job teaching all, he's got experience teaching all the way from fifth grade through high school and even into the college level. Uh, he's going to be running the math summer camps for grades eighth grade. And then these two new things that we have this year is we're trying to differentiate They're kind of algebra oriented summer camps. And in particular, for those students typically going into ninth grade, uh, that would they would be taking a full year of algebra. That's certainly the case in the math academy and at many schools. And so for any student going into a full year of algebra, it could be at some schools that they're doing that even in eighth grade. But if it's preparation for algebra, we have what is called an algebra prep summer camp. Be mostly, I would say, rising ninth graders which also reminds me for all of these summer camps, make sure you don't get confused because it's designed, when I say it's the sixth grade summer camp, that means it's for students going into sixth grade. And so we call that a rising sixth grader. So over the summer, um, the other new summer camp that we have, totally new summer camp that we have is for those students who need really more work with algebra. They already took a full year of algebra, presumably in ninth grade, what we might call algebra one. And now they're stepping into 10th grade or 11th grade. And it could be that, well, before they step into 10th grade, they wanna solidify what they just learned in ninth grade with algebra one. Or it could be that, oh, they're getting ready for 11th grade math, which in many places would be an algebra two course. And so to get ready for that, we're gonna really review what they did perhaps a long time ago with Algebra One. Um, and so that's uh, a lot of what we're doing. I do wanna mention uh, also that yes, I very much advocate for having for students really forgetting about all their academic studies, including math, but we have very long summers here with our, uh, in, in North America for one and with the Math Academy in, in general. And uh, I'll, I'll sometimes a little bit of a refresher for, through that long vacation, it can help to have a little bit of refresher before we start back up with the next academic year. So that's it. I wish everyone to have a joyful summer and uh, hope to see you at the summer camp and wish you a lot the best. Um, I wish you much success going into the coming school year. Bye for now.